Hello, hello friends. My name is Kim and you're watching All Things Kimberly. Today's video is going to be stuffing the grandbaby's binder. We're trying to create generational wealth. So if you're interested in that, let's take a look. This is my binder for all eight of my grandchildren. I think I've got the money in here, yes, from the February challenge. That was a uh, craft, let's see, no, Happy Mailbox Co. That was what I was using every month to stuff their binder. I've now switched that to Jamie's Realistic Life's Mini B book. So, take a look at that. And also, this was from Lisa Grateful Me, Happy Mailbox Co. on Etsy. All right, we have 10, 20, 30, 5, 45, 55, 60, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. I am probably going to be upping it to 80 next month because I'm trying to get out of using so many ones because I want to start um, my bucks challenge, the letter bucks challenges, and my OCD will not let me not put these bucks into that binder. I won't be able to put them into other binders. That's just my OCD self, but I'm trying, that, that's my thinking. So how I'm gonna do it, I'm not sure yet, but we will figure it out. Okay, let's get started. I've got my ones over here beside me if I need to make some change this month. Let's get going. Okay, so you see over here, we have something new. These are my own challenges. I wanted to get everything switched over to. I'm trying to make things a little simpler than the ones I have in here. So I'm gonna separate them and we're gonna change them out as we go. All right, up first is Storm's birthday. This is the one I was using. And now we're gonna have, uh oh, I didn't need to pull this out. We're gonna stuff $5 into Storm's birthday. So he'll have 55. And that will mean we need to set up this little tracker. And if you all haven't set up a tracker and you're brand new, that's why I wanted to go ahead and do it with you. Okay, as you can see, I have 25 balloons on here. My goal for their birthday was $300. So you take the 300, divide it by 25, that equals $12 a balloon. So let me get my pen. Each balloon will be $12, which goes against what I'm trying to do now that I think of it. I may have to up this just a tad. We might as well go ahead and do it. Let me get some white out. I am trying to get out of using ones so that I can start using them on my bucks challenges. So let's fix this. If you all haven't seen it before, this is my little travel kit that I carry with me. It has white out, glue, erasable pen, scissors. Look at the scissors. Isn't that cute? I don't know, I get sidetracked you all, but <laughs> scissors. I carry a permanent marker, a beautiful uh, regular pen, and of course you have to have nail clippers. I don't go anywhere without nail clippers, but anytime I'm leaving, I throw this in my purse, my backpack, whatever, and I keep all my highlighters on the outside. I got this, I think, at Michael's in the planner section. It's ages old, look at it. It's all beat up, but it still works perfectly. This come with a A6 binder I bought on Amazon. Okay, I digress, I get sidetracked, but oh well. So we are gonna up this to 15. So 15 times 25 balloons is 375. Their birthday money just went up. Just because I'm trying to get out of ones. <laughs> okay, so Storm has 55 in there. 55 divided by 15 equals 3.66, so we can call her three balloons. I 
I should have just left all these open since I'll be using the same colors throughout. Okay, so 15, 30, 45, 50, 60. I will need to pat $5 in for next week and that'll give us another balloon. And then we can start trying to keep up with it better. Okay, so let's see how this is gonna look in here, you guys. I have not even put one in to make sure they fit or anything. Oh, perfect. Oh, okay, so this will go to the side. Graduation. Storm is getting two dollars. There we go again, but let's see where we're at. By next month, I want to have this all rectified. See how complicated this was? I wanted to get out of being complicated. I wanted to make it easier. So, now Storm is going to have 20, 30, 1, 2, and 3, 33. Our goal here was 500. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 8, 12, 16, 24. So, 500 divided by 24 is 20, 83. They're getting a bump again or they're going down. We'll go down on this one. We're going to make each one of these worth 20. Well, wait, the hats are worth, I'm going to make each of mine worth 10 and 10, so it doesn't matter. Like I said, I'm trying to get less complicated. So each of those is worth 10. So in this, he has 20, 30, 1, 2, and 3. And you know what we're going to do? We're going to put this 3 to the side. 20, 30. We're gonna do a black cap. So there we go, $30. And I'll leave this one in there because it's got the white front on it. So it makes this look pretty. Okay, Storm's Investments. He's got his fake money in here. But we are adding, let's see, $10 to his, his investments. So 10 and 15 now, and that fake money is slickery. Okay. Let me see. This is going to take some doing, so hold on. Our goal for investments was 480. Look, see how complicated you guys. Each of these were worth 20. Let's see, 480 divided by. On this one, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 48. We're going to up that to 50. And that will be. 500, so they got a raise on this one. And he already has one, two, three, four, 20, four 20. So I'm gonna do 45 and 50. I'm making some executive decisions here to get this binder straightened up. Okay, 10, 20, 5, 30, and he's got this 20, so 50. We'll see how this ends up. So, 450. And I'll see how I want to color these. I want the bags to be green. So, 100, 2, uh oh, wait a minute. We're only 50 away. That's going to be easy. He's only 50 away from what he needs.
Okay, I'm trying to decide if I want to color anything else on this. And I think that's good enough right now. You can make it, well, I wanna show you what it could look like. Okay, all right, I'll go back and color the rest of these later, but you can make it very pretty and colorful. That's why I went with just the black and white. Oh, I'm excited. I'm excited with that. Okay, again, I'll have to make a new white one, so right now we're just gonna leave that one in there. Okay, that is one for each of storms. How cute is that? Okay, I'm gonna go to Miss Scarlet and I'm gonna get her investment done because I don't wanna run out of money before I do Scarlet because her and Storm stay exactly the same. 100, 200, 300, 425. And we're gonna add 10, 15, 20, and five. We are winging it, you guys. So one, two, three, four, 20, 30, five, 40, five, 50. Miss Scarlet has hers. Let's go ahead and stick this part back in there. And we'll stick the front cover back for now, but we are gonna pull her investment. write down here each one of those is worth 50 and it will be for 500 and you can look what those permanent markers do on the back and this is 110 pound cardstock but that's okay I don't mind I like doing it on just plain paper sometimes with since these are long term and I don't reuse them a lot. I did not laminate them, but you can absolutely laminate them and then take alcohol, or I like to use a nail polish remover and a cotton swab and clean them up. Okay, let's do her birthday. And I'll go back and look at Storms because my memory is shot, y'all, and see exactly what we put on his. I'm thinking we did, oh, let's just look. Oh, here it is, it's on the outside. 15 and three balloons for 45. So that's what we're gonna do for Scarlet. So 20, 30, five. 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. Miss Scarlett will have 45. I thought I pulled her birthday one over here, but if I did, I got it lost in this shuffle here somewhere. Okay, 15. And that made our goal 375. Oh, wait, I am working. <clears throat> I'm working. Oh, Scarlett loves pink. Uh, I am working on some extra little challenges for the babies 
This is not really pink, <laughs> but you will be seeing those very soon. I pulled the unicorns out of the savings challenge because that is part of what I'm working on for them. So they will be getting some extra money on top of this money. No, you know what? I keep changing my mind. I'm going to do purple because I think purple looks girly sometimes. Melody loves purple and Scarlet. Or Scarlet used to. She's more of a pink girl right now. Okay, so there's that one. Let me think. What did we do in Storm Scarlet? So, that was birthday. I put it in graduation. Happy graduation. Graduation is 10, and they've got 30. Hold on. I have made a mess of things, you all. As usual. Oh, yeah. Here's her money. <laughs> and the card and everything. And you all are probably yelling, Hey, Kim, you're making a mess of things. Okay, let's see. And here she should have 15, 30, 45. And I can't, let's see. If I can make 45. I'm going to just going to switch it, y'all. 20, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 41, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay. And okay. We'll put this over here. Birthday here. Flat back here. And I think we've got birthday almost straightened up. All right. Okay, there's birthday. Yes, I've got it in the right place now. Okay, graduation is $10. See, we're about to run out of money, you guys. And Storm has 30 Scarlet, we will do the pink. I need a really bright pink for Scarlet, but I don't have it. I could use this. She's that. She loves pink so much. Scarlet is my granddaughter that's autistic. So I like to do the colors she likes. Okay, coming up soon, you will see I have made a huge mistake. Those icons for graduation should be 20 each. Okay, so that we remember we said 10 and 10 each. I don't want things complicated. So right now, our, oh, our goal was, two, was it? Two, four, no, two, four, 480, I think. Let me find it. I didn't write it down, did I? So 10, one, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twenty times twenty times twenty. I thought there was twenty-four of these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twenty, ten, fifteen, twenty. Okay, twenty times ten. Oh yeah, four hundred. Okay. My brain may confuse all of us. Okay, so we are done with this one, and we are done with this one. Uh-oh, I need one of them for the white part, don't I? Okay, so Scarlet. Let me see through that one. Oh, well. I need $30 in here for Scarlet. Let me get some change. So we have 20, 30, 40, and 50. 30 is going in Scarlet's graduation. And we 
got Storm and Scarlet Street. Right? Yes. So 30, 45, and only one left. And we have Storm at 45, 30, and only one left. Okay, let's see what we've got left. 10, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. So right off the bat, I'm going to lay this 3 over here. Well, let's see. 10, 20, 1, 2, I'm just going to go ahead and do one more graduation for Storm and one more graduation for Scarlet this week. They're the ones that need to be done first. And we'll decide more for next month. And I have tinkered with the idea of taking their birthday money and graduation money and just putting it in investments and starting over on birthday and graduation because I really want all of their investment money done first. Because they can draw their dividends. There we go. And we'll see what we're gonna do with that money that's laying over here. Oh, ours is pink. can probably hear the side-by-side -side riders. We've got a couple of younger kids over there and they keep riding. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. So, that's not enough for Storm and Scarlet's. Okay, let's go to Troy. Mm. And you know what I'm going to do, guys? Storm has... The birthday one is 15. How much does Troy have in here? Exactly 15. So we're not bothering birthdays. So I can color one thing on there. Graduation probably is 15. Yes. And graduation needs to be 20. So we're going to put five in Troy's. One, two, three, four, five. That'll get him on the right road. And I'm going to go fill their trackers out off camera. And it will all be ready for next month. And then we have one, two, three dollars left. I'm going to put in the back of their binder. And I will make sure for next month we will get... $77 plus this three, which will equal 80, which five will multiply into, and we can quit using the ones. Okay, I'm gonna do my best to get that done. <laughs> all right, I appreciate you all so much for watching. I know this has been a little all over the place. I wanted to show you how my brain works when I'm setting something up. So, I'd say you either liked it or you hated it. <laughs> one or the other. But anyway, I appreciate it. And thank you. And if you enjoy this type of craziness, please consider subscribing. Give me a big thumbs up and leave me a comment. I love to chat. I will catch you in the next video. And as always, enjoy the journey.